welcome back to the coin pusher today we're doing a five million dollar buy-in they gave us five quarters for five million dollars we're going to set them over here on this left side because the quarters are hanging over the edge a little bit over here hopefully we'll get a nice push i got three of them in we got well now we got four in we got one more to go oh nice we might get a push here come on come on big push oh yeah come on come on you can do it Oh, nice. We got, I think, about five or six quarters back. Oh, we even got a second wave there. Uh, let's see. I think the left side is probably our best bet for now. That was all of them. Ooh, we got quite a bit back. Let's see. Yeah, I think the left is still considered the best side. There's quarters hanging over the edge. Oh, there they go. Oh yeah, it's a good push. Nice, nice, it's going good. Oh yeah, we keep getting more and more quarters. Uh, I think at some point we're gonna have to put some on the right. Let's do the, go ahead and put a couple over there. Go across the whole field. Oh nice, that's left side is still doing really well. Oh wow, we got some gold bars. And quite a bit of quarters, sweet. Got a whole handful of quarters now. They got it loaded up pretty nice, so wish me luck. Hopefully we'll win a whole bunch of this. There's like two great big pyramid looking towers made out of $25,000 chips. Oh, that pusher has got a great big tower on it. That's like a humongous tower. Mega tower made out of $10,000 chips. Uh, and it, I can see through the end top from the top of it. And it's got uh, two, no, three mystery bags on it. And a bunch of quarters on the, on the inside. So it's probably pretty heavy. However, there is a $10,000 chip ripping out of the base of it right there. So that's good. Oh, sweet. We just got paid out some more gold and, and uh, $10,000 chips. That's good. I'll sweep some more $10,000 chips by the base of that ginormous tower. Pyramid towers are advancing pretty well. They've got one, two, four mystery bags on the red shelves. And like I said, they got those three up there on top of that great big tower. It's like a big mountain looking thing. I think it's huge. It's moving along really well though. We're getting some huge pushes on it. I think we'll get it here soon. It's, it's super wide. Well, you can see it. It's extremely wide, so... It's a lot of surface area for the quarters to press up against. Oh yeah, it's gonna go any minute. Any second, possibly. Oh my gosh. Oh, nice. We just got in, into the $25,000 chips. That is the big money there. So we got $5 million in this game. As long as we can get back our $5 million, we are golden. Speaking of gold, there is quite a bit of gold in there. Uh, right here is a bunch of gold, and then on the mirrored image of it, over here on this side, there's a bunch of gold as well. Oh my, that huge tower. Here it goes. Oh my goodness. There it is. Oh my. It's sliding down the wall. Oh no, there you can see the mystery bags I was talking about. Oh, the uh, machine got stopped out. It, it's stuck up against the glass. Stuck really hard. I'm gonna push that still stop, see if it'll release some pressure. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Slowly working, isn't it? Come on. Come on, corner pusher, you can do it. Ah, oh, sweet, it knocked that tower over over there. Oh, this one is also falling over. I think this has got it, come on. Oh yeah, we got it, come on, keep it going. Yeah, baby, nice. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, no. We shoot this all the way full. Wow. Oh yeah, it's just raining out of there. Oh 
Now, where'd all those five thousand dollar tips come from? I don't remember seeing those in there. They must have been hidden inside the tower, maybe. I'm not sure. Let's keep it going, though. It's pushing really, really well. Should we uh, lower that camera down? You think? Yeah, let's do that once it quits pushing. Hopefully that's a little better. Wow, some mega pushing going on. I'm loving it. Oh yeah. Probably need to be positioned on the corners. It's kind of inevitable that the quarters will fall in the center as well. We should probably try to go for the, for the edges. The center is going to push really well. The corners are always the most difficult. It's all moving forward pretty decent amount. Yeah. Make it rain. Oh, sweet. So I'm talking about that was a nice little thunderstorm there, wasn't it? A lot of five, ten, and twenty-five thousand dollar chips. It's raining out of there. You know what? I'm gonna go find some of the mystery bags. We'll, we'll see what we got in those. We'll be right back. Alrighty, let's do it. Let's check it out. See what's in these mystery bags. Oh, sweet. We got one of the white dice and one of the golden dice. Let's see what else we got. Oh, sweet. We got one more of the white dice. Oh, nice. We got the uh, $5,000 tower and the gutter chip. That's incredible. Let's see what else we got in this one. Oh, sweet, another white dice. Oh, we got the green reset chip. And a thousand free quarters. That's incredible. Let's go ahead and turn this in, get us a thousand extra quarters, and then we'll get right back to pushing. This is amazing. We done pulled quite a bit out of here. A little over our uh, five million already. So it's a pure profit from here on out, which is super nice. It's a good feeling right there. We got the center cleared out. The corners are moving pretty decent. Of course, we got quite a bit of quarters now. We just got an extra thousand of them. I think I'm just going to push kind of evenly across the whole field. I'm not trying to put them in the center, but. That's just kind of how it, how it goes. For some reason, I just can't get them to not go in the center. You can either get the right side, like that right there, is as far right as you can go. Or you can do the left side, which I'll show you. That right there. So the center basically always gets quarters, no matter what you do. No matter what I do, anyways. Unless I drop one at one quarter at a time, but I mean, goodness, that would take. You know, we're already spending like 12 hours a day playing this game. I, I don't want to make it like 36 hours. We wouldn't even be able to get a video out every day. If we dropped one quarter at a time. It might take a couple days to, to get anywhere. It'd be extremely boring. I didn't think I could manage to watch that. Goodness. So yeah, I'll try to keep a nice flow going. Seems to pay out a lot better. Push is pretty decent when you get it loaded up nice across the whole field. Compared to one quarter at a time. I, I feel like anyways. I could be wrong. 
but it seems like it to me. Let's see, we're gonna have to have a strategy here in a moment. Uh, what we should do? Probably should turn in the green reset chip. Yeah, yeah, that would be the best bet. Uh, so what's gonna happen is the green reset chip will get us uh, everything that's on the red shelves. So there's quite a bit. Um, that free $5,000 tower chip, that's exactly what it says it is. It's going to get us uh, an extra tower made out of $5,000 chips. Sometimes it'll just be a couple of chips. Sometimes it'll be a humongous skyscraper. And other times it'll be anywhere in between. And we also got the gutter chip. The gutter chip is a pretty rare one. Um, there is two holes in this machine. There's one right there. And there's another one right there. Technically, there's a third one down, down right in there. But, uh, items are falling in there, and we don't get to keep any of that stuff. That goes somewhere else where the the owner gets to keep all that stuff, uh, unless you get that gutter chip, and then uh, they'll take it all out, put it inside the machine, like in this area and in this area, for us to have a chance to win it for a second time. Sometimes it'll just be what what we had lost, and other times it'll be multiple games worth of stuff. It all just depends on the last time somebody won that 1025 chip. Uh, sorry, it used to be called the 1025 chip. Sometimes there still is the 1025 chip, but most of the time it's the ghetto chip now. So excuse my excuse me on that one. That for years and years it was the 1025, and recently they changed it to the ghetto chip. There's uh what 50 grand over there on the right side. I can't believe we already got the center and the left completely cleared out. The right side is like right there on the edge, getting ready to go. Doing so well. This will probably get it. You betcha. Ooh, I was wrong. Oh yeah, there it is. All right, let's turn in the uh, green reset chip. This one here, get us a free... No, this will, this will get us everything that's on the red shelf, sorry. And then we'll get right back to it. Oh my goodness, it's getting ready to go already. I think it's going to fall on the red shelf though. Oh, sweet. There it goes. It saved a little more than I thought it was going to. It's working out pretty well. We've got the uh, free $5,000 tower chip. I will turn that in. That'll get us a free reset because we already used the green reset chip. So that's fabulous. Uh, the gutter chip, it'll also give us a free reset. So looks like I got two more resets out of our way. Oh, nice. When them tires fell forward, that is perfect when they fall forward. I love that my favorite. Ooh, look at all that gold. That's a lot of gold. Goodness. Uh, sweet. All the big money, $25,000 chips. Almost every one of them fell straight forward into the pay. Now they are. Every one of them is. There's so what, four towers standing? It's kind of one, but it, oh, oh my. A little bit of it fell forward. I gotta throw the loot sheet out. There we go. A lot of five thousand dollar chips out there. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. Hope you all having a fabulous day. Yeah, he 
These five thousand dollar chips are moving along real quick, like. Clear that loose sheet out again. It was overfilling. Normally, just the gold is what gets it clogged up like that. It gets too full. Stuff will fall down in that extra hole I was talking about down there. We don't get none of it if it falls in there. So we do got to be cautious with that. Typically, it'll just overflow out the front and into a big old uh, like a catch thing we put all of our winnings but occasionally them gold bars stack up in there and they'll clog it up so nothing can exit out of it and eventually it overfills and stuff falls inside the machine It is my responsibility to make sure that doesn't happen. As if we don't already got enough going on, trying to make sure the quarters go to the right place. It's a real challenge to, to do all this. Not nearly as easy as it looks. A lot of, a lot of years of experience going on here. Over 30 years now, goodness. It's, time goes quick. Time definitely goes quick, that's for sure. Sure didn't when I was younger, but the older I get, the quicker it goes. It's crazy. Wow, this is pushing really well. Um, we about got it completely cleared out. I think to conserve quarters, um, let's go ahead and turn in the free $5,000 tower uh, chip. This here will get us a free tower made out of $5,000 chips. I know there's a bunch of them already in here, so hopefully they'll build us two towers, but if not, they'll build one ginormous mega structure, hopefully. Anyhow, we'll be right back. Oh yeah, that's not bad. They got, what, three great big old towers in there? All of it's made out of $5,000 chips. Uh, we do have, my goodness, I'm not sure. I think three or four mystery bags we need to check out. We'll check those out here pretty soon. So we got that gutter chip as well. So there's still quite a bit of game ahead. And we gotta roll them dice. Also. The uh, white dice are multipliers towards the poker chips, and the golden dice are multipliers towards the gold, if you happen to not already know that. Now you do. Seems to be pushing forward pretty decent. I got uh, basically the whole rat of that pyramid looking tower hopped over. Maybe we should be putting the quarters in the center. So they should push around that pyramid tower a little bit. Kind of push towards the edge anyhow. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's working. We're getting some marvelous pushing going on right now. Oh, uh, timber! Pushing forward real well. Oh, 
Oh yeah, cha-ching! You can pay that big time in $5,000 chips. Probably should stop pushing directly in the center. Start working around the edges as well. Let's check out these mystery bags. Turns out there is four of them here. So let's check them out, see what's in there. Oh, we might get a push right here. Let's see. A little bit. Oh, nice. Check that out. Two golden dice and a white dice. I'll take it. Let's see what else we can get. Oh, yeah. Two more of the white dice. Wow, we're getting a lot of dice in this game. Oh, sweet. Three white dice. Wow. Let's check out this last one here. This one's kind of heavy. So we'll see. Oh, it's a golden dice and a white dice. That is awesome. Oh, sweet. The tower on a rat just moved. That's like the most stubborn spot for a tower to be, is in them corners like that. I think the one on the right is getting ready to fall over though. It's definitely moving around a bunch. Yeah, I think it is gonna fall over. Oh, the one on the left has just moved. It's going on the red shelf. There it went. Should be a lot lighter now. Hopefully we can get a majority of it to go into the pay. It'd help if I quit dropping too many quarters down the glass. Down the front of the machine. Well that left tower I feel I feel like I just seen it move. And the one on the right is not budging. There it goes, it moved a bunch right there, but we're out of quarters though, I'm gonna grab some more. Oh yeah, the red side. Getting ready to pay out, I think, but we're running super low in quarters. I'm getting kind of worried. We still got the gutter game to go. Of course, I guess that'll get us back our quarters. As long as we got enough to get back a couple quarters while we're playing that game, we should be all right. So let's go another round. Hopefully we can get some progress. Oh sweet, I think uh, this was standing up earlier, wasn't it? I think I fell over while I was grabbing the quarters. It, it takes time to get them quarters. Time and gravity really helps out a bunch on this game. Got pretty fortunate on that, I believe. Oh yeah, 
left corner is moving. Oh, sweet. Getting paid out big time now. Just had to keep at it. quarters real quick. Alright, let's get to the quarter out of the way. We're going to go this round here and if, uh, if we don't see some drastic improvements here we're going to move on to the gutter game because we are really really low in quarters. the quarters in a little thinner Let's see if we can get a few extra back come on come on coin pressure you can do it oh my that left side is about to pay out big time I think Cha -ching. nice Oh yeah, I'm loving it. It's doing great. Oh yeah, even the right side paid out some right there. Well, we got a couple of quarters left. Let's get them in. I know that was a pretty good round, but I think we probably should go ahead and turn in that gutter chip. Yeah, let's do that. All right, we'll be right back. All righty, we're at we're playing the uh, gutter game. Um, the woman, she told me she said, "I'm sorry, Joe. There's just not enough room for me to put everything in the playing field. So we'll get you one free reset. So, uh, do me a favor and try to get some of this out of here for us, and then uh, we'll put everything else back in the playing field." So, well, you could have built a great big old tower. She's like, yeah, but it takes a long, long time to sort everything. And I'm like, yeah, I get it. I, I do that all the time. I have to sort stuff. It takes hours. We spend a couple hours a day just sorting um, quarters and chips. So I, I, I can relate to what she's saying. So I was like, yeah, that's fine. Let me uh, play through a round or two or whatever. And, so she'll walk by here in a little bit and uh, uh, put everything that's on the red shelves back into the plane field. So that's pretty nice. Some of them probably just would have left the excess down inside the machine and not mentioned it to me. I would have known no difference. That was awfully nice of her. We got the pusher shelf cleared off. That's some really good progress. There's quite a bit on them red shelves. Goodness. We should have a whole bunch of quarters next round. Speaking of, right there was the last of them. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grab everything and hopefully she'll you happen to be walking by while we grab everything because it'll take me like 20 minutes to sort that out and then uh, we'll be right back. Alrighty, let's keep her going. You know something I just realized? There is no uh, mystery bag in the gutter game. That does happen time to time. It is what it is. 
We're still gonna make a fortune on this game though. We got five million dollars is what we paid for it. Uh, we did get the insurance when we turned in that uh, green reset chip. So we got 5.1 million actually in total. We pulled more than that just in chips. We got all those multipliers to multiply our winnings by. So we're gonna pull a, a nice little jackpot out of here with or without an extra mystery bag and a jackpot in the, uh, the gutter game. It probably will be a jackpot win. Oh yeah. Should it be a good push? Nice. Sure was. Absolutely marvelous. I don't know if you noticed, but it seems like we got quite a bit more quarters. We're up to, uh, well, we done run through most of them, but we had about two baskets worth. Pretty decent. Now we're down to our last last handful or so. We are gonna lose it looks like 15 grand of that rat gutter, but that's alright. We're just paying it forward. It'll help somebody else out when they get the gutter chip. If we're lucky it'll be us one of these days. Getting, we might get that same 15 grand back tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. But uh, I'm out of quarters. I'm going to grab some more. All right, let's keep her going. We about got it completely cleared out of there. So it's pretty much all right there on the edge now. Oh, yeah. Sweet. We got the right and the center cleared off. I'm sorry, we got the left and the center cleared off. Let's work on this right side. Okay, there's 10 grand. There's what, 30 grand to go. Get it. Get it all out of there. And we'll get on to rolling them dice. Hopefully they'll land on some really good numbers. We got quite a few dice so far on this game. Well, no, I guess we got them all that we got. We should not be getting any more of them, but we got quite a bit of them in this game. Definitely enough, we should make a pretty good jackpot win, I would assume. of it. What, 15 grand to go? Come on. Oh yeah. 
that's moving on up. Come on. Sweet, we got it. Nice. Oh yeah, they're moving up pretty quick like when dice are. Hopefully they land on some good numbers. About to find out. Oh sweet, a three and a five so far on the gold. That's a really nice. Well, we got a five on the white dice as well. Kind of looked like it was going to flip over there for a second though, didn't it? Well, we got a six and a one on the gold. The ones don't count. It's got to be two or better. It's got a one, a two, and a, and a four. Oh my goodness. A five, another one, a four, and there's one setting on the side between a two and a six. And it flips over to a six. So that's pretty nice. Uh, let me uh, tally it all together and we'll be right back. It's all together. We pulled $23,560,000 out of there. And then White Dice totaled it up to 32. Turned it into an astounding $753,920,000. That is amazing. We also pulled 50 ounces of gold out of there and them golden dice totaled it up to 14. Turned it into 700 ounces of gold. All in all, that's not too bad for a $5.1 million buy-in. Not bad at all. Well, if y'all enjoyed the videos, do me a favor, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And we'll see you on the next one. Y'all take care.